Welcome to this tutorial. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to make an abstract wave effect. Partial credit to this tutorial goes to uh, GimpTutorials.net and Gimper.org.net, sorry, uh, because this is basically their tutorial. Okay, first you're going to open up file new image 640 by 640. Uh, just make sure that your image is square. Then you're going to go to filters, render, clouds, and then solid noise. And click randomize, turbulent, and detail, put in three, and leave the rest of the settings alone. Click OK. Then you're going to go to filters, render, clouds, and click on difference, difference clouds. And you can leave the settings alone. And click OK. Then you're going to go to colors, levels, and put the white, uh, white slider, move it left to 180. So. And then move the gray slider to the left and put it about 1.80. Okay, and then click OK. Then you are going to go to uh, Filters, Blur, Motion Blur, and you're going to go to Zoom, and for Length, uh, uh, it has to be, Blur Center has to be 320 by 320. And then for Length, you are going to do 60 and it you don't have to wait for the preview because it, it's going to take a while to load and it's going to take a while to motion blur I'm going to come back when it's almost done okay it's almost done and there we go next you're going to go to filters distorts whirl and pinch and you're going to put the settings to one hundred and sixty and you can leave the rest on default and click OK and it may take a while depending on how fast your computer is and then you're going to go to layer duplicate layer and you have to have the second layer selected and then go filters reshow whirl and pinch which basically just reshows it and then you're going to set angle to negative four hundred this basically reverses it and click OK. And you're going to go to layer mode and put it on um put it on lighten only. Sorry. Uh where is it? Lighten only. Lighten only. There we go. And then we're going to flatten image by right-clicking click, right clicking on this and click flatten image. Then you're going to add color to this by going colors, levels, sorry, colors, curves, and change this, change the channel and put it on green first. And you're going to move this to about there. And you're going to move this to blue, put the channel on blue, and move it to about there, which gives you an orange-red effect. Click OK, and you have your final product. And just click Save, and you can save it as whatever you want. OK, uh, thank you for watching my tutorial. Uh, please comment or do whatever you want. Basically, it's a free country. Thank you for watching.